Hey there, it's Paul at Blue Toad. Today I want to show you how easy it is to create a channel and add content to your edition or your site. Um, so I'm sharing my screen. I've got the Blue Toad dashboard open. Um, we have a bunch of content on our dashboard, but one of them is our website. So I'm going to head down to the site. And on the right side, there's a, a gear icon with the option for LilyPad Pro. So I'm going to click on that. Uh, once I've clicked on that, I'm in the launch pad for the Blue Toad website. This is basically that menu uh, that you see when you're on the site. And you can see we have a lot of different content. Uh, there's channels, there's uh, video feeds, there's links. Um, and first, I'm going to show you how easy it is to add one of these elements and specifically a content channel. Uh, you click on this Add Destination button in the top right. You're going to have a, a bunch of different uh, destination options to choose from. I'm going to click on the live article channel option. And I simply give the channel a name and click save and it's done. And I've created a new channel. Uh, so in a matter of moments, that can be done. But what we're going to do today is actually add article content to an existing channel. And uh, we're going to add it to our features channel right here. Uh, there is an icon on the right side called article list. We're going to click on that. Now I'm in the article list for uh, the features channel. You can see I already have content and articles uh, already in existence. There is a button on the right. This is add new article. We'll click on that. And we begin the process. So to start, all I need is a, a title. We're going to call this content channels. I'm going to click the create button. And the article is now created and we can add more content to it. Uh, first. Uh, part that we see here is the ability to add images. I'm going to add two images. I'm going to start with the preview image uh, that we're going to use, add that. And I'm also going to add a header image for the top of the article. So we'll add that piece too. So I've got my two images. And now I see uh, an interface where I can um, now edit the actual copy that uh, exists underneath that article. So first thing I'm going to do is just grab this header image and just drag it into the top so that I have my main article image uh, already in place. Now I uh, head over to the left side here where I can actually add uh, text. And instead of typing the text out, which is an option and using these elements at the top, um, I've already got the content uh, ready to go. So I'm going to uh, just copy this, come back into my article and paste it in. There we go. So you can see on the right, I instantly have all these elements. Now I'm going to go in and add a little bit of formatting. So we've got a few headers in here. Uh, so I'm going to create a header out of, so what's a content channel? You can see on the right side that just uh, made that more of a header. And then I've got a couple sections underneath that that I'm just going to add some bold elements to. Just to make those stand out a little bit. Uh, generally, when we're creating article, articles, we're trying to keep them pretty simple. Uh, I've got another couple questions here. We'll create headers out of those so that they stand out. There we go. So I've added all my content. Uh, I'm ready to publish. I'm just going to click the Save button. And give it a second. It takes a few seconds for that to save. And as soon as that's done, uh, this article content is going to be pushed out through that channel and will be published to anyone who has a link either to the site or the edition or that specific channel. And that's all it takes. There we go. We just got the confirmation that it was saved. So it was that simple. As you can see, it just took a minute or so to create a new article, publish it, add my images, and... Um, and to be up and rolling with it. So appreciate your time. Hopefully this helps and uh, check back. We'll uh, try and provide some more videos like this to just show you uh, as we add and build features into the site.